Welcome to another session from LearnReason.com. My name is Matt. This video is sponsored by HDRefills.com. Hear and feel the difference. Go check them out. You'll be glad you did. So in this session I want to quickly go over setting up Reason's song templates here uh, and the default song start. And of course, you have three options here, empty, empty rack, uh, a template that you choose, and a song, the last song startup, whatever you like. But for the purposes of this tutorial, I think it's always good to set your song, your default song template to be something that you truly use the most often. It will help out your workflow. And then with your, your templates, you can set up a number of these for your specific tasks. And if specifically, if you have a panorama P1, P4, or P6, you're going to have to set up the surface locking for each one of these and save it. And if, because if you set it up once, Reason does not save this as like a default setting in each song or template. To set it up, you go to Options, Surface Locking, Select your panorama mixer mode and sec, uh, select the mixer section. You can set all these different other ones too, but for this tutorial, this will get the, the panoramas working really good with Reason. So now I have that set up. Now I'm just going to save this as a song, and I'm going to call it One Song Start FX. And I'm going to save it right to my desktop. So that, that's saved. And now I'm going to save another one here. Then, and I want to want my uh, piano, a favorite piano that I like, the uh, Pro Grand piano. And I'm going to create a track for it right here. And then I'm going to set up a, just a redrum. So now every time I s select this one, this... Uh, uh, the songs, this song file that I'm going to name, I'll just be able to play right from the start. I, I won't have to think about it, which is great. Okay. Okay. So that's, that's, I like that. So I'm going to select, I'm going to select the piano. So this is selected. So now I'm going to save this as, I'm going, name, I'm going to name it two piano and drums. Simple. To my desktop. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the templates here, and I'm going to open up the templates folder. So it's right here. So now I can minimize... Uh, uh, reason and I'm going to put these two right in the folder and now because I've named them one and two they're going to sit right here at the top so it's going to be this one this one and then next uh, the track recording demo number 16 so if you put the numbers there first that's how it will sit on the in the list or it will go by alphabetical order so now in reason I just do one more thing here what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to preferences you know I'm, I'm clicking on the folder here and it opens this up and if you're in reason 8 this is what it does and if you're in reason 7 or before you can still do the same thing so in in, in uh, OSX you go to users let's go you go to music reason and then you know your uh, templates right there and now you'll see the templates. And I'm going to choose the piano, and I'm going to select it. So now, if I go back to Preferences, this is what's going to open up every single time with the piano selected, and my Panorama P6 will be ready, be ready to play the piano. And if I press play, the, the re-drum will start drumming, and I can set the tempo and, and start writing 
you know, uh, music. Really, really simple. So now I can just go through the rest of these that I want to change. If I like the album mastering, I just open it up and then save it as album mastering. And then you're going to have to drag it back into the templates folder. Save it to your desktop and just drag it in there and replace it. I can just go right up here to options, uh, service locking, select my, pan my panorama, uh, mixer section, save, and now save this as mastering. And I'll save it right to my desktop. Now I just uh, drag this file into the templates folder and the mastering one, album mastering, I, I'll just move it to the trash because it doesn't work with my uh, panorama. And that, that's set up. It's just that simple. So, you know, I, I just wanted to make this tutorial, short little tutorial to, to show this for all the people out there that have the panorama P1, P4, P6. And also, anybody else using Reason with any other controller, I mean, it's really... It's to your benefit to set, up, set this all up, all your templates here. I mean, there's no reason to have the factory ones there if they don't work for you. Or you would like it to be different, or you'd like to make this list smaller, or you want to have your, your preference, uh, your default song, if you want it to be a specific thing. You should take the time to set this up because it will make a huge difference um, when you start using Reason. So, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Please like, share, and follow. That's how you can help out here at LearnReason.com.